Hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed for another technical video on LaTeX. In this video, I would like to let you know how to write matrices in LaTeX. There are different commands for writing matrices in LaTeX. I will try my best to review all of them very briefly. So let's move to the document. Like my previous videos, I'm working in the document class article and the packages needed for inserting matrices into the documents are the same as needed for mathematical equations. That is AMS fonts, AMS maths, and AMS symbols. So without any further delay, let me move on to the introduction section of the documents where I build matrices. And I would like to begin from the index matrix first. So here I have written the command for ntx matrix. Let us try to understand this. The ntx matrix can be inserted by using the command small matrix. So I'm writing here backslash begin small matrix and n small matrix. Then I'm putting backslash left followed by a bracket and backslash right followed by a bracket. So these two commands in fact encloses your matrix inside parentheses. I put a dollar sign at the beginning and would like to put a dollar sign at the end. So this complete the whole command for the matrix. The next thing is to understand this thing the ampersand separates columns so a comes in the first column and b comes in the second column the double backslashes separates rows so a and b are elements of first row and c and d are elements of second row in order to see this let me build the document so you see here's a two by two matrix and inline text is generated. A matrix in a full equation can be inserted by using any environment for equation. For example, you can write a matrix in the equation environment and you can write a matrix in the align environment. So I would suggest favorably use align environment. It has a lot of flexibilities for writing equation so let me remove the percent signs from each line and understand what this gives if i build the documents and see what i have so i have a three by three matrix let us understand how i have inserted this for equation with matrix enclosed in parentheses you write p matrix First, I develop the equation environment by writing the align command, begin align and end align. And then within this environment, I start for begin P matrix. So the command P matrix encloses your matrix in parentheses. And the same thing goes, I'm, I'm putting ampersands to write to columns so there are three columns a is separated from b b is separated from x therefore i have three columns and then i'm separating the rows by putting the backslash double backslashes so it is the p matrix gives a matrix enclosed inside parentheses on the other hand i have another command b matrix let's see what the b matrix gives us by removing the person signs so the person signs removed in the equation environment along with the matrix environment is activated. If I put the cursor over the begin command, so if I put the cursor on the begin command, I see in the uh, I see on the window a three by three matrix now enclosed inside the square brackets. So if you favor writing your matrix in square brackets, it uh, suggests you to write B matrix. And if I build a document, I can see that on the main page. You see the same matrix with P with P matrix command, it is enclosed in parentheses, and with B matrix command, it is enclosed inside square brackets. 
you can write determinant by using the command v matrix so in order to see this let me first again remove the person signs from each line and again if i put the cursor sign over the begin command i see a determinant in the background so if i build the document you see the determinant of the above matrix is now written so v met so the command v matrix in fact gives determinant and if i make the v in v matrix capital then i get a determinant enclosed inside double parallel lines to see this i activate this command and i build the document you see here the same matrix is now enclosed in pairs of parallel lines. If you need to write matrices in the same line separated by certain fixed distance, you can do that by writing them under a single math environment with the help of QQuad command. You will see I have double matrices written in the same line separated by a fixed distance. This distance is in fact inserted by the command Q quad. So Q quad separates to different matrices or generally to different equation written under the same environment without putting them on two different lines. I hope the short video tutorial would have helped you in writing matrices in your document using LaTeX. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't yet subscribed Safi Max, don't forget to press the subscribe button and be with me for developing your skills and technicalities and different research softwares.